Hey, what is up guys? Welcome to RAM Overload. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to get rid of this chat GPT message that something went wrong and when you do it, you always keep getting it and it's not able to generate anything for you. So just to show you guys, let me just type in something. Um, uh, ideas on AI. So whenever I search that, you can see something went wrong. If this issue persists, please contact us through our help center at help.openai. And then when you go to help that open that AI, and you can go here, chat GPT, and then over here, we want to go here and let's see what this says. It says something went wrong. Please try again in a few minutes. Free users may receive this intermittent server error like these during high traffic. Alternatively, try starting a new chat. If these issues persist, you'll need to disable any VPN or anything. So one thing I've noticed is that, you know, even if you do a new chat for, well, in my case, um, idea, I, I always get this no matter what, right? I'm going to keep getting this and even chat, you know, sometimes it'll work. Uh, but most of the times I do see this error, right? And now to solve this error, if you're having a similar thing, you want to do a couple of things. First, what you want to do is delete all your cookies and your browser history on not history, uh, your browser data, right? And then from there, you can try logging in again and seeing if it works. So let's just do that. So if I have this extension over here. I can kind of just remove all the cookies and everything, right? And if I refresh it, it's going to tell me to log in again. So All right, let's log in again and search. See, now it works perfectly fine. So that's what you want to do. So if you are interested in what this thing is, this extension is called Cookie Manager. I'll leave a link in the description below so you guys can just download this plugin. It is available on Chrome as well as you can use it on Microsoft Edge or any Chromium browser, you should be able to install it. Right. Um, alternatively, if you're using like Firefox or a non Chromium browser, there's probably plugins that do similar things, but yeah, you just want to try that and, uh, see if it works and hopefully it should. Other than that, if you have any questions or comments, leave them down below. I'd love to help you guys out if you other, um, and don't forget to subscribe and like this video if it helped you out. Other than that, peace out.